Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for All Sun, Moon and Rising Geminis. This is the month of July 2017. This is the first um, month in the first half of the second half of the year 2017. And I want to say to each and every person, thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. It is going to be a month of uh, changing. Um, a lot of um, angelical beams are coming in. A lot of angelical beings are coming in so it's going to be a month that you're going to learn to connect with your um, intergalactic beings and um, the um, cosmic energies that work with you Gemini's in this um, month so it's going to be a wonderful wonderful month the month of July has the energy vibration of the star the energy of the star is an air energy that is going to help you to bring you a lot of wonderful um, manifestation all of you that have been manifesting you are going to find out that the energy vibration um, you're going to start manifesting in this week and it's going to be wonderful it's going to be a profound time in your life because the energy of the star is the energy vibration of wonderful manifestation coming in and um, the month of July have the energy vibration of four weeks and in this four weeks the two four weeks for you guys is going to be the energy of fire um, fire but yet still um, a good uh, thing the third week you will have the, the energy vibration of uh, um, the Empress which is the earth energy vibration and the Empress will be bringing you your materialistic needs so this is going to be a profound wonderful month for you because it's going to be a month of abundancy and love and for some the waiting game for some the waiting game so your energy vibration is going to be the ace of cups for you Gemini so wonderful energies are coming up for you Gemini's because um, abundancy and love and that sort of a thing is going to come in in this month uh, for you guys it's it's only four weeks uh, the zodiac energy we begin with the energy of water and we end the month with the energy vibration of um, uh, water and um, uh, water and fire okay um, I'm so sorry I'm a little bit distracted um, because of the eat okay so um, I've changed up the readings um, you know I'm always changing up and it's not a matter of changing up it's just a matter of variation um, you can do readings in um, different ways and different types um, of ways and this is how I um, do my readings I think that we should learn from variation and not being doing the same thing all the time okay um, your best week as I'm looking at it your best week is going to be the last week your best week is going to be the last week um, it's more for you guys of working with your passion the fire energies the passion and that sort of a thing it's more about work for you guys and this week it's about bringing stability and balance uh, to your work life so whatsoever is happening it's a week of discovery um, in the first week in the second week is bringing strong foundation miracles are have happening and um, you're also being a really really um, a lot of um, promotions in the second week and in, in the third week uh, we are going to have uh, um, you having to hold on to fate and uh, to have fate to have fate to learn about uh, um, using fate uh, um, to help you through and this is going to be um, really really positive you have the number nine energy is uh, you have three times nine three times nine so a lot of you people will be starting with your divine part ways because it's as, it's as if the alarm bell is ringing for you guys uh, and what is happening is that um um, in the last week which is so wonderful about the last week is that um, a lot of connection business connection and that sort of a thing is going to happen um, a lot of promotion as I've said in this week in the second week and the last week you will see a lot of promotion in the first week it is all about news new endeavors are coming in it's all about discovery the first week is all about discovery the second week is all about um, 
the second week is all about um, you know achievement and promotion and uh, miraculous things working out for you and the second week is is about uh, um, you know faith learning faith going within and um, seeking within and seek a way how you can move out of certain aspects and certain things in your life whatever that was happening to you um, it is finally ended um, you know a very a bad situation that has been happening it is finally ended and I want to say to each and every persons this is going to be profoundly wonderful it's going to be a fantastic month for you guys because as I see the lay of hair uh, love is uh, um, not one of the best forecasts for you guys in this month it's all about work it's all about getting your balance getting yourself a balance okay remember this the number nine three nines I'm gonna write it down because um, you guys need to um, need to know what's happening um, for you guys in the month so I've always uh, said that I was gonna write the numbers down and um, uh, for you guys it's going to be all about the, the three nines you have three nines in this month here is another nine so it's three nines um, uh, there's an eight but there's not a lot of eights two eights so that is also good um, so you have 88 also so it's 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 all about wonderful achievement the six a uh, wonderful achievements which is going to happen to you guys okay so here we go um, as we look at your month I'm using the crystal Tarak and this is it and in the first week we have the energy vibration of the eight of wands which is a fire sign it's all about a lot of um, new opportunities coming in for some people it's all about new messages a lot of messages coming in to people a lot of things are going on for a lot of people and this is going to be extremely positive what's to have reduced that is coming in is discovery there's going to be discovery about certain things that is coming in which is wonderful and um, your chakra energy is going to be the energy of discovery so whatsoever is coming in it's all about information that is coming at you and you're discovering certain things that you weren't aware of so this is just positive the red is the energy of your chakra is the base chakra so that is uh, um, your energy of the base chakra is here and the base chakra um, with the discovery you're discovering a lot of stuff that you weren't aware of because I'm working with the chakras to people you need to know your chakras as we look at what else you'll be working with is your shadow shot your shadow side your shadow side is coming up and that is where you're getting all these information from the shadow side is always when your guides and angels are prompting you the intellectic and galactic and beams are connecting with you and releasing information to you so it's a um, as I've said the cosmic energies and the cosmic beam are going to be working in the month of July from July onwards uh, they're going to be coming in frequently and you're going to feel them so the shadow side um, is more of the side where um, these um, spiritual beams or um, international uh, in, in, intergalactic beams are coming in, and, uh, and there you can see in this in this picture that um, the art chakra is being wakened door and angels of a guide of us of, of, of a masters so the masters and godinas and all those beams will be coming in to work with you in this month of July and remember people um, each month bring out new things and as I, I, I am saying to you guys uh, um, the intergalactic beams and the cosmic beams they start they've started to come in and you are going to feel the presence of them so um, you are going to leave the earthly form the 3d form in the first week and you're going to connect more 
with the intergalactic beams okay they are going to bring you message which is extremely good um, here we are um, we're bringing balance we're bringing balance and you're going to bring balance to yourself in the second week a lot of people are going to get a lot of promotions which is going to be wonderful a lot of promotions are coming in in this uh, second week a lot of promotions a lot of doors of opportunities um, a lot of people will be going elevating moving up the ladder um, in business because it's all about business in this month it's all about work and business so a lot of people will be so elevated that you Gemini's because you are one of the smartest zodiac signs so you're going to see a lot of positive energies coming in and you have the energy of miracles for your chakras so this is beautiful I don't know why the angels don't want to I'll let you see but this is beautiful the energies um, that is coming a lot of miracles a lot of things are just going to happen miraculously because in the first week you have seen that discovery is here where your spirit guides and the universal beams are connecting with you and releasing information to you and this information is going to help you to go forward and this is just a wonderful wonderful promising promising two weeks of July for you Je uh, Gemini this is going to be extremely wonderful as we look at the last energy that you have you have the energy of firm foundation you have the energy of firm foundation and you are building a firm foundation in your life with whatever you're doing if you're a business person or you are um, working in a company elevated you are going to be so promoted elevation miracles new things are going to happen to you miraculously and uh, your your uh, feel of stability is going to um, be returned so this is extremely good I should say this is a, um, a positive sorry my hair is always scratching my face this is going to be a positive positive endeavor for you guys and this is going to be a wonderful sense in the first two week as we go to um, the third week we have the energy of the Empress which is an earth energy vibration and she's going to come in to bring you your financial needs she's going to make sure that she brings in your financial needs and this is money um, extra money um, extra work and I um, extra work and that sort of a thing so extra situation where you can make money um, um, she's gonna bring blessing in some people are going to start buying new cars new house there because they have uh, uh, in the second week of a balance in your life so um, it's like new cars and a new house I'm getting an energy of new cars and new house for some people and uh, some people are going to move to a better place that sort of a thing some people are going to make a huge investment in the third week and this is going to um, be good do not worry just have faith if you have decided on something and you ask the universe to deliver to it have faith that it will be delivered if this is your divine life purpose and this is the plan for you the universe is going to deliver it to you so be aware of this situation that you need to have faith hold on if there's someone you miss if there's someone you care about and you really want to have a relationship with this person and the universal uh, beam think that yeah this is the right person but it's all about money it's all about bringing um, balance in your life in the third week this is all about the financial aspect you're going to be moving on from something and this is going to be um, good because whenever we move to something that is better whenever we leave something behind you're 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 looking on to move on to something better in your life and this is the number eight energies and this moving on is that you some people will decide to um, leave a, a, a job to, to find something else and this is where you'll be elevated and promoted and from this elevation and promotion you're going to look in buy new houses and that sort of a thing so this is where I was getting the energy of a lot of people looking forward they're leaving their old jobs and they're looking to find something new and they want to build and they're they're on their financial 
um, situation and bail on um, their financial world and this is going to happen because whenever you um, get promoted that is more money and then with more money you are able to um, do more things so this is going to be a possibility for most of you out there so the third week is a wonderful week it's looking good and um, um, it bring balance because the Empress is the energy vibration of this motherly finger that is bringing balance into your world and she is saying to you have faith because I'm here to bring you your materialistic needs and she is going to release this to you so this is going to be good as we move on and we move further to the last and final week, we have the energy vibration of the Six of Wands, victory and success. Good news is coming in. So congratulations, you guys out there. This is going to be an extremely, extremely wonderful um, a week uh, the fourth week because whatever um, situation that was happening in your life whatever was blocking you whatever have hold you back these um, energies are sort of lifting now and you are seeing wonderful new possibilities wonderful new things come in your life and you're vibrating at this energy vibration and you are going to get a message um, of good news it's on its way in the fourth week so this is going to be wonderful so for instance people who have moved and have elevated to a new um, promotion in your work this is going to be a wonderful exciting time for you because you are going to get good news in the fourth week so whatever that is it can be over work it can be over your student loan and uh, that sort of a thing and the next energy we have from the chakra is the energy of the blue so work with Archangel Michael in this blue in, in this uh, um, fourth week and it says important and you need to um, manifest but yet still hold on manifest but yet still hold on don't push forward against the flow you need to learn to go with the flow so sometimes people manifest things and it's not coming in right away and it is time that you give it time so it can comes in, come in with the flow and as these things start as you start to work with the flow and go with the flow in your life you're going to see new positive things coming up for you and these situations are going to clear all that was blocked and this is bringing you the good news so be aware of what energies you're giving out out there again there is going to be a wonderful wonderful connection um, so this is going to be a positive positive time um, membership um, with each other this energy is a, such a positive energy it's working together so what's the is happening especially for the people who have started new job you will be appreciated movement and success so you will be appreciated so think of the people who have transformed to a new a job or started for themselves or whatever the situation is that you have changed your whole entire career and went in a different line if it's going to work out for you so if you have been thinking should I change my career should I try something different do it because it's going to happen for you in the month of July this is the month of July where people are changing their careers and you Gemini's are going to change your careers and you're going to see um, a lot of success coming in and a lot of people but a lot of partnerships and success will be coming in your life and this is going to be a time of positive endeavors that is going to come in your life so again we have the six of ones and we have impartial and it is an end of situation that was affecting you in your life and these situation that has been affecting you in your life it seems to be helping you to elevate yourself and move forward in a very promising way so this is a month of promotions and success for you guys it is um, the month of work and with uh, the work um, that will be coming in it will be a, a sense of uh, um, you being 
so wonderful it's as if whatever was happening the waiting game is now over and you can go forward in your life so abundance you know it's 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 a time when um, the number eight energies is here but also it is a month of abundance and um, love it's 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 a, it's it's a, it's a time where the waiting game is over you know um, the waiting game um, is over and um, you're going to start now seeing um, um, promotion in work um, you know work promotions um, and um, you're going to you know love is not one of the most foremost energies but um, you'll be having a lot of abundance a lot of abundance um, so you know um, a lot of abundance will be coming in so you know this is a promising month for you guys so whatsoever you're doing whatsoever the waiting game is over okay um, is there any more energies um, you know remember you um, Gemini's are always thinking you Gemini's are always the sign who are always thinking and manifesting and um, what your spirit guides and international uh, intergalactic beams want to teach you is how you can learn to just listen to them and discover the wisdom within you um, and then they want you to understand and believe that miracles do happen and there is still the energies of miracles and if we ask we call upon the universal angels and ask for a miracle towards a situation that is happening in our lives that they will send a miracle and in the third week it's all about uh, you know you are having a time to move away from something that is no longer uh, working for you and uh, this is a situation um, that you'll be moving from to something better because you want to build uh, on your life and you want to have a good financial foundation so it, that is the sense of this month that that is what you will be focusing on um, in this month as we go forward in the energy of love um, what is the energy of love for you Gemini's is that there is going to be um, a break um, a lot of you are going to um, release yourself from certain relationship a lot of you are going to walk away from certain relationships a lot of you are thinking about ending your relationship so it um, it is um, these intimate relationships that are not working is going to fall away from you okay it is as if uh, in the first week uh, the intergalactic beams came in and connected with you and your guiding angels came in and connected with you and showed you and let you and, and give you information that you have made discovery over a certain relationship and uh, you have uh, decided to end this relationship in the first week you in the second week there is nothing about love it's all about you focusing you're moving up the the ladder the, the the career ladder and it's all about you focusing on your career and moving up that career ladder and believing that there are miracles and knowing that um, with you believing that there are miracles and asking for miracles it's going to happen because you have a very strong foundation you're you're you're, you're standing good you're in your energy you're in your aura and it's going to happen for you in the third week the energy of love comes but the energy of love is for the material world some people in the third week will have a connection with an earth sign person and this is going to 
become something or um, yeah this is going to become something so some people are going to connect with either um, a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn person and it's more of a feeling of a Capricorn person it can be a Virgo but yet still it can be a Taurus it depends on who you are more attracted to who is in your birth chart and whoever this earth sign person is you are going to uh, want to um, uh, connect with that person but yet still you're moving away out of one relationship into a new relationship so you want to give it time so that whatever that should be ill from the old relationship eels before you move into this relationship but some of you will be having um, and we'll be thinking of an earth sign person whoever the person is okay as we look to the fourth week in love it's all about there is no love nothing of love in the week except love the fourth week except love for yourself so this month is going to be um, the first week you're deciding to break um, contact with and, and 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 you know break off your relationship for the ones that are not working not for everyone just a relationship that hasn't been working the relationship that has been you know going one way to another the relationship that hasn't been working you're going to decide to put an end to it and you are going to do that and that is um, the best thing to do because uh, this has um, the lesson that you should have learned uh, you have already learned these lessons so you need to move on okay we're going forward so that was the energy for love and that is just for um, the people um, who um, you know you know the other thing that I see is that the men um, for the women if you're out there looking for that right person for the women it's going to happen for you it's going to happen for you you're going to meet the man of your dreams but he will not be your twin flame but you will meet the man of your dreams for the women so for the women who are looking for a relationship you will meet that man but it's not your your twin flame it is going to be that man that you want to um, bring in your energy vibration and it is possible for you ladies okay all right um, as we go forward and we're looking at the energy um, for um, business business is going to be great business is going to be wonderful the energy of business is going to be performably good and um, business whether you have your own business or you're working for someone whatever it is sales is going to be good um, you're going to start learning how you manipulate the energies and by learning that you're going to see good things happening and good things coming in your life and good things happening in your life so this is going to be extremely positive so you know um, the energy that is here for business is going to be a profound positive one there's going to be a lot of promotions happening in this month for you Gemini's a lot of um, climbing the ladder of your career is happening um, just wonderful things for you Gemini's for the ones who are positive and realizing and it doesn't really matter what kind of career ladder you're climbing once you are moving up in an organization or in the company that you work for or you know with your own business what you're doing then you're going to see a lot of success coming in to you in this month okay um, as we go forward and we look at um, the zodiac energies which is uh, the Sun rising Gemini what do you need to expect and who will you be working with um, in this um, um, month of July um, you have the energies of the Taurus so again here I'm confirmed confirmed um, um, conf confirming that the um, energies of the earth sign people will be vibrating with you Gemini's because uh, here we are with the energy of the Taurus the bulls they will be working with uh, you guys in the Sun so remember the Sun 
sign is the people who were born six o'clock until 6 p.m. that is the Sun sign and the energy of the uh, heart sign people of the the Taurus is will be working with you the other energies for you Sun sign people is going to be the planet of um, Jupiter and the planet of Jupiter whenever Jupiter is going to work with someone and this is why I understand your reading now the planet of Jupiter is working with you because the energy of miracles is here and the on and other other energy of uh, having faith is here the other energy of going with the flow is here um, so discovery is here so Jupiter is the planet of good luck and Jupiter is going to bring you sun sign people a lot of luck it is going to be so much luck coming in for you sun sign people which is going to be a wonderful wonderful endeavor so this is a promising promising month of July for you guys because for you sun people you are going to be working with the Tauruses and the planet of Jupiter and this is going to be extremely good because working with Jupiter is one of the most profound planet because it brings you only good luck if you are in the energy vibration of holding a positive energy you will only see these good luck coming in your life as we move to the sunrise and moon sign we are going to work with the energy vibration of the Libran so whatever is happening for um, the Librans the energy of uh, a Libra is always the balancing of the scale so a lot of you moon people will be balancing out the situations with other people and the Libran is always the card of justice also so if you're having lawsuit and that sort of a situation you will have a huge win in this lawsuit and um, if you have been balancing the scale properly balance is going to come in your life in this month because you're focusing more on um, bringing um, balance your financial situation in balance and not in love so for you um, Gemini's it's it's going to be a wonderful month uh, for you um, moon sign people because when you work with um, the the energy of uh, um, the Librans and especially working with the Librans this is a profound um, wonderful time for you guys because what is happening is that whatever imbalance you have in relationships uh, in your in, in emotes in um, whatever aspect that is in balance within yourself uh, your purse the personal aspect who you are your characteristic and this sort of a thing then you will see that that balance is going to come in Mars is going to be the planet which is another wonderful wonderful energies that is going on because the planet of Mars coming in Mars is going to help with the sense of career so I I am you know just confirming um, certain things uh, for you guys because you can see it here that when Mars comes up uh, Mars is the planet that rules uh, and the energy of Mars is like a fire energy but yet still um, you be connecting uh, you know with work and that sort of a thing with the Aries uh, and that you you be having and carrying that Aries energy because uh, um, that Mars energy um, is what the uh, the energy of the Aries carry in uh, you know and what rule the Aries so you will have that sort of a fiery energy and this is is, is good I can see why um, you know you are getting the fire within because you need to bring um, balance in your life and this is going to be good so again this is a positive positive month for you guys so whatever you're doing for you um, um, raising the the moon raising sign whatever you're doing it is going to um, be a positive endeavor in your life because um, with the planet of Mars coming in and working with you you are going to see performed wonderful energies that is going to affect you in a lot of wonderful and beautiful ways and this is what I've always said to people is that um, Come um, connecting and learning that you when certain planets are in your chart what is going to happen and this is going to affect each and every one of you Gemini's in some 
some form of way in some aspect of who you are and this is a profound wonderful time whenever you can realize that um, you're connected with these planets and these planets as a whole lot to do with you as a spiritual beam on this planet or whatever beam you are whether you're spiritual or non-spiritual but um, it shows you the connection of um, who you are and how you exist um, with these planets in your birth chart and this is what I'm teaching people okay we have come to the last and final card and let's see what you guys have okay clarity personality power and self-esteem so I am getting that a lot of you because this is a um, a random light the um, radiant light radiant light so you're bringing back and this is to heal your um, your power heal your uh, solar power your solar power you're bringing back your power okay all right I'm gonna hold it like this what does this card assist you with and what you need to do in this month clarity you need to look for clarity which is um, which is really good because uh, the clarity that you'll be looking for you'll be discovering that in the first week personal power yes that you will be finding also in the second week self-esteem you'll be finding in um, the last week and uh, the third week you'll be finding self-esteem because then you'll be aware that you can change your own vibrational uh, um, energies so so it supports whenever you hold your finger like that see it's just like this you know whenever you hold your finger like this see that's how you do see these two last one um, what you're doing is supporting digestive system and the acidity um, as the main of the life expression you're increasing your metabolism and detoxation you're energizing um, efforts and help to cultivate passion clarity and personal power oh my gosh okay I'm sorry <laughs> I wasn't aware of this so here I am so this is wonderful so caution digestional issues yeah I have digestional issues because I'm lactose intolerant and that sort of a thing use caution with this though use caution with this if you don't have digestion in the system you need to use caution with this and the focus for you guys is that my inner light is vibrant and illuminated and alive so my inner light is vibrant illuminated and is a light so I will write it down yes 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 I have started doing writing down the numbers and writing down um, what it is that you need um, to work with in this time and it's going to be a wonderful perform wonderful wonderful experience for each and every person out there I'm still holding it I wasn't aware so this is good this is bringing me clarity and person and, and awakening my personal power but yet still it is self-esteem you're working with your self-esteem and this is going to be wonderful so this is a very um, wonderful energies you know I'm guided every month um, by my guides and angels so I'm going to do um, two of this I'm guided every month and this is how you do it you know and it looks like this at the back so I'm guided every month um, by my guides and angels to choose the card decks and um, this is wonderful because what is happening is that every time whenever there's a shift and a change and the energies are changing my guides and angels will um, you know move me towards whatever I should have and this is wonderful because I myself is learning as I go by 
So I want to say to each and every person out there, it's going to be a wonderful, wonderful blazing month for you guys. Uh, there's not much love only um, for the ladies. If you're looking for that person that you have been uh, um, vibrating, you have been putting out the energies and saying to people, this is the type of guy I want. He's going to, you're going to meet him in this month and it's going to be a wonderful perform then for the men it is uh, um, the men will be leaving behind and not only men but a lot of people are going to be just leaving behind relationships that are not working any longer and um, a lot of people will be moving on and focusing on their careers and building themselves okay um, it's a vacation period for the students the rest of the students they are elevating themselves they're doing extra schoolwork and that sort of a thing so um, these Gemini's are just smart kids and they always go for what they want so uh, if you have a child and it's a Gemini you know stimulates that person in whatever area they want to go in and help them to elevate themselves and I want to say thank you for being here please remember to like and share these videos listen to your Sun moon and rising sign and also go back and listen to the general readings because general readings has a lot of information also go and listen to the third quarters I will set all the links down down the bottom of this video or I set the the, the videos on here so I want to say to each and every person thank you for being here thank you for being back this has been a wonderful profound time in um, our lives and for you Gemini you air signs is good to be doing this and I'm saying to you guys namaste until next month